Has this guy commented on your channel? Maybe he said something nice like, cool video I really liked it. Or nice content you deserve more subscribers. Well I've got news for you. Every. Single. Comment. Is fake. How do I know this? He commented on one of my videos not long ago. And I immediately knew something was wrong. The comment seemed lifeless. And he didn't even like the video. I had a feeling he was spamming comments. So after doing some research, I quickly discovered he was commenting on hundreds and hundreds of videos with the same style of comment. Videos ranging from video games, to makeup tutorials, to world news, to Chinese lessons. I went over some of these examples in my last two videos. The truth is, Tamar uses bots. Or more specifically, scripts. Scripts that write comments on his behalf to post on small channels. Why would he do that? Okay. Picture this. You have only a handful of subscribers and don't get many views. Then suddenly, this guy comments on your video saying you deserve more subs. Okay. This guy is really nice. Who is he? You look at his channel and find out he's really popular. You feel special that someone so popular looked at your video and so you become interested in his channel. And there you go. He's just gained another viewer based on a fake comment. Now multiply this by 10, and 100, and a thousand. This is why he has almost 500,000 subs. It's not because of his YouTube success tips. Which I'll get to in a minute, but it's because he's kickstarted his channel using fake comments. So what's the harm you might ask? Well, what's the harm in spray painting a wall with graffiti? That is essentially what he's doing. He's absolutely filling YouTube up with his fake comments. And aside from the annoying comments, he's only making content to make money, so he has no passion for what he's doing. How do I know? Well, look at his video lengths. They are spot on 10 minutes. That is a clear sign he is either trying to get monetized, or already is monetized. And you'll find that if you actually take the time to watch his videos, which I force myself to do, you'll notice that basically all of his advice videos cover the same topics. He repeats himself over and over and over and over and over. He even goes against his own advice. In one video he says, keep your videos to 5 minutes to get better view durations, then in the next video, he says, make long videos that are 10 minutes long for better view duration. And the irony is that he promotes his viewers to respond to the comments they get on their videos with the automatically generated responses which is a YouTube feature but follows up with it saying I don't recommend to do it all the time. Because it's kinda robotic. And if people find out then they'll know you don't really care about them. That's funny to hear coming from someone who uses bots don't you think? Overall, this guy is basically cheating the system and getting money from it. And even if he isn't getting money at the moment, he's setting himself up to get money from future uploads due to his corrupt popularity. And to top it off, he makes absolute garbage content, asking people to subscribe and like and enter into competitions by spamming comments on his videos, which really just boosts his own statistics. YouTube is a place for passion. Where people can showcase their creativity and grow a community. People like Tamar who cheat the system and have no passion for what they do, don't belong here. Thanks for watching.